Hey guys, what's going on? This is Linis here with iWish Jobrickson and today I'm here with a review of the all new CD8 we call CC Quick Pro. Now, as you can see, I have got my control center open right here and everything looks quite normal, but the thing that's different with CC Quick Pro is that you can slide down on the application shortcuts and basically add a bunch of toggles including kill background, respring, go into the system settings and you can basically change a lot of cool stuff over here and you know customize iOS 7 and you can also perform the home button action, the lock button action you can also go into your app switcher if you like it does come with a lot of other different toggles like Siri and you know 3G power off and reboot now other than that this tweak does also come with some settings so let's just go into settings and open up CC Quick Pro settings now as you can see you can go into the status bar gestures and you know swipe right swipe left, double tap or hold. Now holding it will take a screenshot, double tapping will open the multitasking switcher like so and you can also swipe left and right to do some other cool stuff but other than that you can also go into hide sections for control center settings and basically hide the setting selection, brightness selection, the media control section, hide air stuff so the air, air drop and air play section, hide the quick launch section as well as you know you can enable or disable the media control section when music is playing of course now you can also go into multitask and you know animate it when you're killing the background apps so if i just try the kill background toggle as you can see it does animate and you know it just kind of shows you that you have killed all those apps you can obviously disable that by using the kill switch but now let's take a look at some of the other stuff that it does come with so you can go into default page and set the default page so if i just hit multitask it will open up the multitasking area and obviously I've killed all the apps so it doesn't show anything but if I just go into CC Quick Pro as you can see it just stays at the normal you know control center page now there are some more settings available in the multitask area obviously there's animate kill self and kill music so if you are playing any music and you know you want to kill that as well as all the other apps in the background you have to turn on kill music and kill self is basically the app that you don't want to kill so if I just try that once more obviously it's not gonna work because I don't have any apps open but let's try opening up something like music and then closing that down and going back into settings and let's try that once more alright so let's go back now as you can see only settings is open other than that over here you can also turn on or off the animate setting and if you just go up as you can see it does have some tips for you now if I just go down I'll show you some of the tips so if you just scroll to the multitasking area as you can see if you swipe up when you're in portrait it will kill the app like so but let's open up something else like the photos application and try that once more but this time in landscape so let me just take off my iPhone off the dock and open up Safari in landscape now as you can see the control center does go into landscape mode just like you know the application that you're in and if you just swipe it back into the multitasking area all you have to do now is just swipe right and it does the same thing as portrait but this time you just gotta swipe right now the tweak is 299 in Big Boss but if you don't want all the gestures that, that it comes with and you know some of the other functionality you can go ahead and try out the free version which is also available in the Big Boss repo. So guys that's about it for this video. If you did enjoy this please give this video a thumbs up. It does help me out a ton and also be sure to subscribe down below to see more great videos like this. So guys thanks again for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.